All right, today I have two silver unboxings. One from uh, Hero Bullion and the other from Money Metals. If you enjoy silver, check out this video. So we'll do the first one from Money Metals here. And what I ordered from them was the starter kit. Uh, I believe it was four ounces of silver what they have in their kit. So, many of you have seen that they put a little packet with assorted marketing materials. Um, free silver if I order again within 30 days. If I order $2,500. Uh, certificate of Authenticity for my Walking Liberty. One tenth. Well, these are all the COAs. We we'll get into those. Looks like pamphlet on the monthly gold and silver savings plan. A buying guide. Um, information about my first order, and then uh, it's like a little newsletter about investing. But let's get into what we have here. So, let's get out of the way. So, if you've not ordered their starter kit, it is four ounces, which is. So their four ounces consists of a one ounce Walking Liberty, a one ounce Maple Leaf, a one ounce uh, Eagle, random date, half Troy ounce uh, Walking Liberty, and then five one tenth ounce Walking Liberties. So first one we've got is the Maple. And then we have, looks like a eagle. Pull this on real quick, pull it out. Maybe because that sticker's in the way or they're stamped, you can't see it very well. But... 2012. It's actually the first true silver eagle I have. I have that one that's painted on it, but this is my actual one I intend to do. It. It's my first one knowing what I'm actually doing, I should say. Get these into capsules here momentarily. And then this one is so the Walking Liberty. With money metals exchange stamped on it. And a half ounce. Walking Liberty. Again with money metals on it. I 
And then five of these little guys. They tape them up as well, but just leave them in there so don't get lost. Cute little things. So that is what. Money Metals gave me or sent me on their four ounce starter kit. Get these COAs out of the way. And then from Hero, my first time ordering from both of these companies. I remember a couple of things I ordered from them, but I don't remember what the bulk of it is because Hero was the one that took forever to get here. And I'll tell you about what happened there in just a sec. I do know is this be rippable. Invoice out of the way. All right. Again, my first time ordering from Hero, so let's see what they provide. First thing is a little card. It looks like it's their mission statement. And then what I ordered is some gold backs. And my thinking was is one I wanted to just kind of cool so I ordered them this in particular but these ones these dollar ones I ordered them to give to my kids four to my kids and one to me and then this one was just to have on hand kind of cool And they were, when I bought them, paid $25 for the $5 one and, excuse me, paid $25 for the five $1 ones and $20 and 20 cents for the $5 bill one. Utah Goldbacks. Figure if you're gonna order them, might as well go with where the very first Goldbacks came from. We'll start there and then we'll maybe get into the other states, but I don't know that I'll collect a whole lot of these just because they're more expensive for the amount of gold you're getting out of it, but they're kind of a unique item. So in theory, this is my very first gold, which is very, very minimal. <laughs> and then I ordered Germania five ounce bar. Excuse me, a Germania 10 ounce bar. And this at the time, I ordered on April 27th. 
and today is May, the time of the video is May 28th, but I received them two days ago. So May 26th is when I received it. So uh, it took a month to get to me. But at the time I bought it, it was uh, 287 is what I paid for it. Uh, I'll have to look at my notes on what spot was on that day. Spot was $25.03 when I bought it. Back to my video here. So what happened with Hero, why I was not a little happy, un, why I was a little unhappy with them, is I ordered right before I went on vacation. Because I knew it would take, by the time my payment cleared, and they got shipped out, that it would be here when I got, I would be back just a couple days before it arrived, which was about two weeks. About five, six days for my payment to clear and go through on an ACH, and then prep time and then ship time, right? So I ordered it, left on my vacation, which was out of country. And while I was on my trip, I received an email saying that uh, my ACH did not go through and that I needed to now send a physical check. And it had to be done within, initially the email was uh, 24, 48 hours I needed to send it in. Well, I was on the other side of the world and not really in a position to be sending out paper checks since I wasn't around any. So I had to play email tag with them a little bit and it let them know that I wouldn't be able to send a check for about 10 days before I got back into town. And then when I did get back into town, as we know, I had COVID for a couple of days. So I had to wait for that to pass before I could get in and actually get physical checks from my bank because they would not do a new ACH. They now said it was uh, once the ACH didn't go through, I know how to do a physical check or they would cancel the order and then I would have penalties. So I finally got the check uh, picked up, mailed off to them, which takes obviously several days to go through snail mail to get to them. And then they finally got it. Then they had to wait for it to process and then for them to prepare it. And then they get it shipped out. Lo and behold, about a month later. The reason why I'm not happy with that is because the ACH account that I've used with them is the same one I used for Hero, and it's the same one I've used for SD Bullion. Um, sorry, excuse me. The account I used for Hero was the same account I used for Money Metals for these, and is also the same account I used for my ACH with SD Bullion on multiple. And so I'm not very happy that. Uh, for whatever reason, I wouldn't go through with them. Way delayed getting it. Anyhow, like I said, it took a month to get here for these items. In the same time, uh, Money Metals was ordered on May 13th. And like I said, about 15 days later, with shipping included, it arrived. And it took hero a month because of their payment system didn't go through and then obviously the delay with me getting back into town being sick and then getting checks so uh, i'd like heroes uh selection and inventory i'm i'm happy with what i got the quality but right now i'm a little not impressed with their you know shipping time and then the hassles of ach is not working Again, when it's worked multiple times with other vendors, kind of makes me want to stick with the other vendors and, and not go with Hero, but we'll give them another shot and see what happens. So let me know what you guys think about what I picked up, what kind of experiences have you guys had with either Hero or Money Metals? Anybody else bought the starter four ounce pack or anything else? Thank you guys for watching the video all the way to the end. Really appreciate it. Been very appreciative for the comments that I've received over the last couple of videos. Really enjoying this process as we go through it. 
and see you guys on the next video.